Frederick Ayers the third was an American actor whose film and television career spanned 65 years. He is best known for starring as a German soldier, Paul Baldwin in the film All Quiet on the Western Front, and for playing yeah. Dr. Kelgear in nine movies. I he was born on December 28, 1908 in Minneapolis, Minnesota, died December 30, 1996 yeah. in Los Angeles, California. He was 5'9". I was born in Diana Hall from 1964 to 1996. Yeah. Ginger Rogers from 1934 to 1940. Laura Lane from 1931 to 1933. Says Justin Ayers. And his parents were Lou Ayers and Emma Ayers. Uh, his movies that he's known for is Young Dr. Calgary in 1938. Yeah. All White on the Western Front 1930. Uh, the second. The Secret of Dr. Calgary in 1939. Johnny Collins yeah. in 1948. Actor Lou Ayers, who started the Academy Award winning classic of Pride on the Western Front, and who was a director lawyer yeah. in life as well as on the film, died at the age of 88. Ayers died in his sleep after being yeah. in a coma for several days, says Diana Ayers, his wife of 31 years. Now Lou Ayers has yeah. two. One of the rarest for the category of motion pictures is located at 6285 yeah. Hollywood Boulevard. And this star right here is for the category of radio located at for the category of radio yeah. 1724 Vine Street, which is between Hollywood Boulevard and the Avenue near the Capitol Records building on the Capitol yeah. Records side. Now he was born in Minneapolis, Minnesota, and we're and moved in San Diego, California. Yeah. began acting in bit player roles in films in 1927. He was discovered in 1927, banjo, playing banjo in the Henry House style orchestra as a star was recording for his earlier yeah. Victor movie shorts called Carnival Night in Paris. Eric wrote, I was a, I was a member of Henry House Star Orchestra yeah. in 1927 at the Mission Beach Ballroom in San Diego, California. For the summer, my instruments were tenor, banjo, long neck banjo, yeah. and guitar. And after a hiatus, I rejoined Mr. Hallsaw with a new group, including Paul Harris on New Year's Eve of the same yeah. year, opening night at the Beverly Hills Hotel on a memorable occasion. Now, Harris played opposite Brent Barber in 1929, yeah. The Kiss, but it was his story role in 1930s, All Quiet on the Western Front, from which Made him a star, Ayers was Janet Gaynor's leading man in Servant's Entrance, which featured a combination of live action and Walt Disney animation and a musical dream sequence. He played the title role in The Young Dr. Kildare in 1938 and became a matinee idol, starring in several Kildare films. During the time, Ayers was co starred with Joan Crawford and James Stewart in The Ice Ball of 1939. Now, Minery married his anti-war and medical roles in his film work. Ayers was a pacifist who fought to become a member of the medical corps during World War II. The United States Armed Forces, however, would not guarantee him that position, so he declared himself a consecrated objectioner and reported to a CPS camp. But having such a well-known public figure taking this stance was poor publicity for the United States Armed Forces. It led to revision of his rule of the rules, at which Ayers then was able to join the medical corps, so he served with distinction in the Pacific Theater and in New Guinea.